In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for each of the elements here in N2H2. So the Ns, these are the blue, purple, and then the hydrogen, that's the white. So we use these general rules to figure out the oxidation numbers. We look down the list and we can see hydrogen when it's bonded to nonmetals, and nitrogen, those are nonmetals, is going to be plus one. So each hydrogen is going to have an oxidation number of plus one. We also know in a neutral compound, we say this is neutral because there's no plus or minus here. All the oxidation numbers have to add up to zero. So we could say plus one and plus one, that's plus two, plus some number is gonna equal the zero here. So plus two and a minus two, that would equal zero. So the oxidation number on both of these nitrogens combined is gonna be minus two. Therefore, each one of them is gonna be minus one. So now if you add all of these numbers up, they're going to equal zero. So to recap, we found the oxidation number for what we knew, the hydrogens. And then we used the fact that the neutral compound, like N2H2, all the oxidation numbers add up to zero to figure out the ones that we didn't know, these two nitrogens here. This is Dr. B with the oxidation numbers for N2H2, and thanks for watching.